Hello Kings, Queens, Nerds and Geeks, Powder Milk here, and today I'm going to be doing um, a little cook video. I know I've made spaghetti in the past in one of my videos, but today I'm going to be making a roulette cake. And if those of you who don't know what a roulette cake is, check out how to cake it, because they uh, did something on it and we decided to do our own little version of it. And um, hold on, let me uh, show you what's going to be, uh, actually strike that. So guys, I'm basically going to show you clips of what's going on right now. Um, my wife is currently uh, working on the fondant, and we'll be uh, basically going through all the steps we're going to be doing. So anyway, hold on guys. So here my wife is currently rolling the fondant, so it's nice and kneaded and ready for the dyes. Which, I'll show you the dyes, hold on, we're going to remove the knife. I want to show them the dyes. So here are the dyes. Not this one. Oh, I can't see it. Hold on, let me move the cutting board slightly. There are the dyes. They're gel food dyes by Wilton. Yeah, so we're gonna be using a lot of stuff here. Um, the fondant, we're gonna be, uh, we're gonna need uh, some different colors in, in the mix. All right. Yeah, we're gonna need 12 different colors because there are gonna be 12 chambers sitting in the cake. Uh, let me, uh... But here's the thing, the original roulette cake actually had gross stuff in it too, and you won't put gross stuff in it. No, I won't, because no one will eat it. I'd say, like, at least warheads or something in, like, one of them. Yeah, hold on. So, here's this. This is basically what the cake's layout will be. And we're gonna put them in these different chambers. And... Here, I'll show you guys the treats we're going to be putting in it. We're going to have Kit Kats, Twizzlers, Reese's. Twizzlers? Yeah, Twizzlers. No, I thought you said Whizzlers. <laughs> and we also got Hookie, Hershey's Cookies and Cream. Hershey. Hershey's. Hershey. And then we got regular chocolate. We got gummy worms we're going to put in there. And we're going to have... I am now prepared. Oh, I'll cut that out later. Uh, okay, anyway, Starburst is going to be in there. We're also going to have Oreos. You need gloves. You need gloves. Yes, I did. They're... Where are they? Hold on. Grab them earlier. Oh, here. Here's some Oreos. Uh, camera. <laughs> anyway, we got Yorks. And also, two other things. Hold on. We're also got... Oh, snap. The hot sauce. We also got pudding. That we're gonna use uh, chocolate, tapioca. chocolate and vanilla. So we're gonna be doing uh, some awesome stuff with these, and basically each one's gonna have a surprise in it. And uh, I'll be I'm about to bake the cake soon, so do the baking process soon. Um, Not mind the stuff in the back. We were having dinner. So, I guess we're going to be doing this intoxicated, guys. I'll be honest, we're going to be doing this intoxicated. What? Jerry, my hot sauce! Sorry, I will be doing this intoxicated. Correction. Uh, yeah, so... Good luck, husband. You have to make the simple syrup. Oh, so yeah, the simple the syrup. You have to deal with the boiling hot syrup. Yeah. While drunk. Mm -hmm. Also, guys, we're, uh, we got a lot of tools. So, hold on. Please, Sorry. Edit. Sorry. You better fucking edit a lot when you're done with this. I have to edit it. You gotta edit a lot, then. So, I'm gonna be uh, doing the cake. Batter. I'm not going to be baking this from scratch because this is going to take a long time. It's still recording? Yes, it's still recording. It hasn't stopped. I can always edit stuff out. Okay. Now... Unlike last time, you didn't edit it out. Here's a tip. If you see your face on camera, don't say anything because then it will cut silence out. Just saying. It'll make it a lot easier. So we're gonna be using a uh, rainbow cake. 
uh, some rainbow, uh, rainbow chip cakes. These are, um, this is actually a pretty awesome cake, since this cake is going to be all about surprises, why not have some rainbow in it? It's mainly going to have a rainbowish kind of style in the cake anyway. So, hold on. You get a nice big old bowl. How much, you want me to make one at a time? Yes. Okay, that'd be good. And it's a bit too hot in this pot. Sorry, not sorry. Well, oh, no guys, this is, uh, we're gonna flatten out this cake. This is weird to do, but I gotta do it. I'll just flatten it out, get all the air bubbles out. Now, the box says we gotta bake it for about, hmm, it says for, uh, how, how many inches is this pan? 12 inch, I believe. 12 inch? Yeah. Where's this say for 12 inch pans? Uh, I want to say for about... Uh, I want to say for about 30 minutes and we're going to check on it. So... Hold on, guys. I'm gonna show you the cake inside the oven. Yeah. 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 You turn on the light. Yeah. Nice cake. So. I wonder how Diego is gonna feel if he reacts to this. I don't know. If he makes a video on this, I swear. Hold on. I'm gonna show you, show them the fondant so far. So this is what my wife's got so far on the fondant. We still got three more dyes to go on this, and uh, I'm gonna pause the video right now. Oh, and I'm gonna start sh working on the uh, the uh, the simple the simple syrup. So I'll be right back. I need to take.
take a break from the fondant because it's starting to, to melt. It is? Yeah. Well, anyway, I just still gotta make this. So yeah. guys, this is simple syrup basically. Uh, powder cake it has something that keep, has a weight, a technique that helps keep cake moist and moist or uh, hydrated. Yeah, hydrated. So it doesn't dry out when you're uh, making the cake. No, and when you're doing decorating. Yeah, so. It basically keeps the cake moist during the decorating process. Yeah, it basically. It doesn't make it any more sweeter. Which you always, you it gotta have. Just makes it doesn't drop. Yeah, you gotta have equal parts sugar and water. So, into a pot and boil it, rolling boil. Here, give me a spoon or something. Or whisk, a whisk would be a trick. You have to bring it to a warm boil, then you take it off the stove and let it cool. Yeah, let's go make some more sugar. Yeah. All the sugar has to dissolve. There, keep whisking. Well, I have to dissolve. It'll dissolve. Anyway, so guys, I'm pretty sure you guys don't want to see this rolling boil here, so I'm going to pause the video so that way you guys don't have to go through that process. So. Okay, that simple syrup, guys, is now chilling in the fridge. That way I can pour it into the squirt bottle later. And now the fondant is all made into different colors. And I hope you, uh, this is going to be uh, made of the different uh, triangle sections of the cake. You know, um, well, also I think the cake, yeah, the cake is still baking. Give it some more time. And we're going to pop it out, see if it's done. And when it is, we're going to let it cool. And then we're going to have to cut off the, the car, cut off the caramelization, right? And then we're going to, you know, let it chill in the fridge. Oh, yeah, that's what I was saying. Well. Uh, wait, say that again? So, yeah, there's a lot of chilling involved and a lot of, of other steps. So I'm going to pause this recording and I'll be back with you once we're, once the cake is done. So, okay, guys, I went ahead and made all the cake, ate all of the cake layers. We're going to have like a total of three, one big layer and two thin layers for the top and bottom so that way the chambers are hidden. And now I'm going to be doing the crumbing, uh, the, uh, the simple syrup and the crumb layer of frosting so hold on guys so we can get right on to that
Okay, guys, uh, the chrome coats are done. Now they have to chill longer. So sorry, guys, I have to pause the video a little bit more because, yeah. Because, got... well, here it is, guys. After this next part is the frosting. And then after that is the fondant rolling and all that stuff, so... The cake is falling apart. So guys, we're gonna be freezing this part of the portion because this is all cake glue, so... So hold on. Okay. Guys, I made this little marble set fondant. It's gonna have like different colors in it and stuff like that. And it's gonna look really nice on the top of the cake. The main, the main part of it anyway. So, um... This next part, I need, by now, I think the cake is ready for the third layer now, so I'm going to continue that in just a sec.
Okay guys, I got the cake frosting as smooth as I can get it, so the next part is rolling out the fondant. Which is going to be hard. So anyway guys, hold on, I'll be right back.
Okay. Okay. We're done, guys. It took me forever. It's like one in the morning. <laughs> it took all night. It almost took me all night. Oh, look at that. Oh, yeah. It's not as good as how to cake it, but it's really awesome. Well, anyway, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this awesome cook video. And I hope to catch you guys in the next one. I'll see you guys later. Stay nerdy, my friends. Bye!